This week, we bring you a power tip for scaling in AutoCAD and LandFX. In this example, I will show you how to XREF images and PDFs into your drawing. From there, I'll use this example to walk you through the AutoCAD scale and align commands, showing you how to accurately scale a project site with a number of different file types. Here I have an AutoCAD drawing that has lost its scale, notes, and other data. Essentially, it needs to be redone. First, let's locate our site. Using the AutoCAD XREF command, use the drop-down arrow to select the option for Attach an Image. Navigate to the aerial in Windows Explorer that you shot from Google Earth. Choose your settings for importing this image and click OK. If I choose to select my own scale, you will notice that once I specify a base point, AutoCAD gives me a rubber band effect for the outline of the image. It really doesn't matter what I choose as my scale as we're going to be changing it next. Navigate to the bottom of the image. It is important to have a scale or at least two points of reference for which to scale the drawing from. Use the AutoCAD scale command. Select a base point to scale from. The bottom left corner will work fine for this example. Again, I get a rubber band effect, but instead I'm going to select the option for reference at the command line. This will allow me to specify reference points on the drawing so that I can then tell AutoCAD that length. Select both sides of the scale and specify the length of 20. Note that my drawing units are set to decimal feet. The drawing will scale to match the reference point. Now, use the XREF command, select the drop-down for Attach PDF. Insert the PDF into the drawing and perform the same steps to scale the PDF correctly. Note that if a PDF is created from AutoCAD, it should maintain the snap points, making this a super easy task. Once you have scaled your PDF correctly, you can easily move it to the correct position based on corresponding line work between the PDF and aerial image. Now that I have my PDF overlaid on the image correctly, I would like to scale, rotate, and locate the native AutoCAD line work to match with the rest of my site. Instead of completing these tasks individually, I will save myself some time by using the AutoCAD command Align. First, select all the line work that we wish to align with my Google Arial and then type Align at the command line. AutoCAD will prompt me to select multiple source points. In this project, I'm going to try to get away with only two. These can be any two points that I know exist both in my PDF and in my line work. I'm going to select the north intersection of the property line and match that to the PDF followed by the corner of the building on the opposite side of my drawing. For the best results of this command, it is good to specify points with more space in between them. Now I will confirm that I would like to also scale my drawing when this command is executed. Hit enter and I can see that all of my line work is located in one position and scaled accurately. For any minor changes, I can select all and scale based on a reference point that I know, such as parking stripes. This has been another power tip. Bring efficiency to your workflow with LandFX.